Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to find the equation of a line given two points on that line. In order to do this, you're going to need to use the point-slope formula. If you haven't already watched my video on using the point-slope formula, I recommend that you do that now. Okay, to begin with, what we need to find is the slope of the line which joins the point 8, 5 and 11, 14. So we take the y-coordinate of the first point, minus the y-coordinate of the second point, and divided by the x-coordinate of the first point, minus the x-coordinate of the second point. So this is equal to 5 minus 14, which is negative 9, divided by 8 minus 11, which is negative 3, and that simplifies to 3. Okay, so the slope of the line that we're like looking for is equal to 3. The next thing that we need to do is we need to choose which of the two given points we want to use in order to find the equation of the line. Let's use the point 8 comma 5. Okay, so now, now that we have the slope and a point on the line, we're ready to use the point-slope formula to find the equation of the line. So we have y equals the slope of m times x minus x naught. So that's x minus, remember that x naught is the x coordinate of the given point that we're using, and that's 5. I'm sorry, that's 8. So x minus x naught plus y naught. y naught is the y coordinate of the given point, and that's 5. Okay, when I find the equation of a line, I often like to leave it in slope-intercept form, so I'm going to go ahead and clean this up. So I'll distribute the 3, and I get y equals 3x minus 24 plus 5. And if we clean this up, we find that y is equal to 3x negative 24 plus 5 is equal to negative 19. So 3x minus 19. That's the equation of the line in slope-intercept form that passes through the point 8, 5, and 11, 14.